the Vancouver Home Design Show is a haven for lovers of real estate and interior design. But in case you are a newbie like I am, we have wrangled a couple of local experts who you might just happen to recognize. All right, you guys, we are finally back in Vancouver with you guys. You have been on a whirlwind. So what has it been like three and a half years with Love It or List at Vancouver? Yeah. So, and, and it's been almost you, that long since we've been on Novus, right? Yeah. It, you blink. Yeah, well, actually, uh, Novus was actually at our launch party yeah. when we started the show. See, it feels like I've only done the show for like three days. Like the time just goes by, but it feels like I've known him for like 35 years. Yeah. So, right? And working with her, it feels like I've been doing the show for 35 years. You look like you've been doing it for 35 years. You know what? When we started, I had no gray hair. And no sound. <laughs> oh. Look at the effect I have on you. It's, it's, a, it's a positive see, and negative. See, this, this is how uh, generous I am. I let her take the credit. She loves to, she loves to take claim. To what, your style or your gray hair? <laughs> Both. Yeah. You guys feel like a brother and sister. Yeah. Yes. Straight up. It's so incredible to fight. <laughs> okay. So we're here obviously at the Vancouver Home and Design Show. You guys are going to be up on stage, but what are you guys going to be telling everybody? I mean, how to design, how to buy a house, even though it seems impossible in Vancouver. Yeah, well, actually, we uh, we talked a little bit about uh, Love It or List It, Vancouver. A lot of people are really interested about how the show works, so we get into a little bit of kind of behind-the-scenes stuff. But we also talk, you know, Jill and I actually, you know, on the show, we, we play the, I guess, the realtor and the designer, but yeah, really, like, we have a lot of the same beliefs when it comes to this industry. We have to play competitors on the show, but really, in actuality, in real life, uh, we would probably we be on the same team. We agree more times than we disagree, yeah. You hear that, ladies and gentlemen? Yeah. That is recorded. You, you've, you've heard it here first. <laughs> but we talk a little bit about making smart choices in terms of what renovations um, add value to your property, and and we look at different rooms that we've done on the show and, and try and... You know, just um, share some of that information with the audience. Now, on the show, it all looks like it comes together so seamlessly, so easily. Um, but to really get like a design like that, for instance, how much work goes into that? What is the Jillian Harris how-to? I'm lucky. There's an amazing team behind the scenes. I mean, the the, the scenes themselves take up a, a big part of my day. So if I actually executed all the designs on my own I would literally be working 24 hours a day so there is an amazing team behind the scenes I know that they go through a lot um, I don't have to experience that I mean at the bottom line the network doesn't want me to necessarily be that stressed out because I have to be on camera and engage with the homeowners and look fresh and bright and airy and so when's that know, gonna happen <laughs> I get Sorry. protected a lot. You know, there is tons that goes on behind the scenes. There's but a lot of moving parts. We have parts. such a huge team that takes care of it so that Todd and I can do our job to tell the story, really. Has there been anything about Vancouver's real estate market that surprised you guys over the course of doing Love It or List at Vancouver? Well, one of the things that I think people don't take into consideration is, first of all, we shoot like four or five episodes at the same time. So we got a lot of a lot of projects going on, a lot of houses. Sometimes we've got three episodes going on at the same time in North Vancouver. Everyone's looking for the same house. And there's only five on the market that happen to fit the criteria. And then you reach out to ask them if you could shoot there. And three of them say no. And so then what do you do? I don't know. What do you do? What do you do? Uh, uh, it's a great question. Sometimes we that's push the day. Impression. Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean, that's something that Jill and I don't have to deal with, but that's something that the production itself has to deal with, like finding those homes and and the other on on the renovation side. Sometimes pulling permits in certain parts of the city. Uh, it's not like we get preferential treatment. You have to submit the permit, and if you don't get it right now, we've got three episodes on hold because we you can't get the permit. had our schedule, our shooting schedule, set up until basically January, and so they'll give us our shooting schedule, and then we fill in the blanks around that with, with speaking engagements and, you know, traveling and whatnot, and then all of a sudden, you know, three projects get put on hold. They need to move the production, but we've already filled in our schedule with other things, so then everybody's going, okay, now what? Now, now where do we get those days from? Because they need to deliver to the network, so there's behind the scene stuff that people don't even see, like having to deliver a, a TV show to the network so it can actually make it on TV. Meanwhile, there's a whole construction going on and, oh, yeah. and designers and homeowners and money. And it's kind of two shows in one. I yeah. mean, a lot, a lot, I think this is a, you know, it's a great format, but a lot of the newer shows that are coming out aren't as complicated, shall we say. I mean, this, this involves like the whole house hunters kind of mentality, plus a renovation. And then they've got like the dynamic between Jill and I too. So we shoot like, we shoot about half the days together. And uh, so, you know, it's a complicated military operation behind the scenes.
I'm bringing my A-game today, Todd. I'm fighting design crime, and I'm out of this world. I just got to make sure you know who's the boss. Wow, George. Why are we bickering? It's what we do best. It really is. I love it.